morning. My name is Charles Taylor. Today is Tuesday, August 11th. Our first our reading for today is from Mark 4, chapter, beginning at the 40th verse. But he said to them, Why are you so fearful? How is it that you have no faith? Faith over fear. Should we think that God is displeased with our faith <clears throat> every time we feel fear? When we look a little closer at today's reading, we see that Jesus says, why are you so afraid? He equates so much fear with a lack of faith. How we can consider what a faith response could have looked like in that boat and what is look what it looks like in our lives maybe if we have looked like the disciples walking walking jesus and confidently asking him for help perhaps they could have assumed that a man with authority over demons and diseases could do something about nature they were all in the same boat. So the same fate awaited them all. All Could a storm accidentally kill Jesus and end his mission? Could it overcome them when they were with him? What do we know about Jesus that helps us measure our adversity against his ability? He overcame death so that our worst fear is behind us. His death on the cross proves how much he loves us. He is, our, he is God, so nothing is too difficult for him. He took on human flesh so we could know he sympathizes with our daily struggles. He has a plan for our lives and no storm can overturn it. Why are you so afraid? Let us pray. O oh Lord, let my faith always win over fear. Amen. <clears throat>